I don't know what is gonna like go down with this Dublin show, but it's like every time I come to the UK, there's always like some shit with these fucking like airline people. And they're just like always like just like starting shit with me, you know. And like I'm on this Aer Lingus flight, and I don't know what the fuck is going on in the beginning. Matthew has my bags. He goes like deep in the plane, puts my bags up, and then the ladies like asking me some fucking questions and I'm you know just trying to find my since I didn't have an answer for her she like went to like a like you know like a couple seats over and she's like staring at me and I'm just like I'm looking at her I'm just like girl don't stare at me like I didn't fill out your Aer Lingus app like work application and she goes to the captain of the plane and lies and says that I said like Oh, like don't stare at me. I'll sort you out. And I'm like, what are you fucking talking about? Like, I'm from New York City. I don't even say shit like that. You know, I don't even like. I don't even use that kind of slang. And then they, just, they all just like crowd around me and like, you know, they're like chastising me like I'm some fucking animal. You know, just like, oh, we're not gonna have a problem. We're gonna have a problem. I'm just like, what the fuck is going on? You know. So I get off the plane. I just, I get off the plane. You know, because I'm just like shit. You know, like. I've like worked too hard in my life to be like, you know, cornered by some fucking like ugly Irish bitch, you know, like and he's like fucking ugly Irish women here, like just trying to fucking and you know, they like send like they like gas me up and then like all these fucking security niggas come over and like you know they're just crowding around me, like treating me like a fucking wild animal. And I'm just like you know, like tried their hardest to get me to like say something or do something or like freak out or you know what I'm just like I'm really like just like trying to calm down right now because calm down and like figure out how I'm gonna get to Dublin like I'll probably have to drive to London like I mean drive to Dublin like I'm in London I'll go pick up the fucking salt and like just get in a car and drive to drive to to Dublin, take the ferry or whatever the fuck I gotta do, but no bitch, you're not gonna play me over no fucking Aer Lingus flight, you know, you're not gonna like d disrespect me and like make a fucking spectacle out of me, bitch, no I can't do that shit I just can't, like I don't have like the, men the mind for it, I can't if there's another airline I can fly, like last minute or something because, and then you know, they try to switch it on me like, oh, now you can never fly on Aer Lingus because I got off the plane. At first, they were trying to like get me to stay on the plane, you know? It's like, what the fuck? But like, aha, bitch, that's why you standing there on the fucking tarmac digging on my fucking bags, sitting there looking stupid, bitch. Well, at least my manager just booked me another flight, so that's cute. But yeah, no, y'all not gonna have me in my seat over no little like cheap ass Aer Lingus ticket with these like old white ladies in here like trying to corner me and make me an animal. F fuck no, hell no. Mm -mm. No, I'm just gonna, uh uh, I gotta walk off that. I gotta get out that flight. So, okay, crisis averted. I'm getting another flight. Oh, I'm not gonna have to drive. Kept like kept saying, call the police, call the police, call the police. Oh, we're we gonna call the police, call the police. It's like, damn, y'all niggas are fiending to put a monkey in a cage today, huh? Y'all motherfuckers just wanna put a nigga in a cage. God damn it. God damn it. I need to make a complaint against Aer Lingus because the girl lied on me. She lied on me. She said that I said, I will sort you out. Honey, when have you ever heard me say that? I don't talk like that. You are lying. She didn't hear that. No, that shit was just so evil and wicked. It was like really like some get out shit. I'm tired. And then everybody was like, you know, like going behind doors and saying little secret things. They was just like building this shit against me. That's why I was like, nah, get me out this plane. No, but it's it's the same shit every time you come to these UK airports. Like they just see Negroes and they just be like all in your fucking face. Like it's like the same shit. I've been touring too long. No bitch, I'm getting off the plane singled out by the haggard old white lady it's like every fucking time it never fails it's always me on the plane with the long weave and the louboutins and all this other shit and they're just like oh who's this black girl in business class you know wait is this the right is this the right floor no, we just back there. one floor down okay they always want to play you like Oh, it's not racism, and then they want to, like, you know, just provoke you in chats. It's just like, oh, it's the same shit with y'all, like, 
y'all fucking ugly ass bitch Aer Lingus bitches. It's always the same shit. Okay, I'm getting out of the airport. I'm gonna go get myself a hotel room and like call some of my friends and just fucking relax. Like, bitch, we can start with no party. I'm gonna rebook my flight and then just like figure it out.